finals. There you go. And the winner of this will move on to play Montgomery and Grands next up. We'll get a little break before that, you know. Okay. Just make sure everyone, you know. To take a tour around. Yeah. See how people yeah, are doing. Check out the Smash Attack menu. But mainly to give, like, the winner of this some time to breathe. Because oh, their opponents have been off yeah. the sticks. Yeah. Okay, we've got a 3DS player, actually. Wow. I didn't, Hype. didn't know All those right. were still around. But you have to connect the 3DS to the console, right? It's yes. Not like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Interesting. So many options in this game. Though. I really do love the fact that they gave so much versatility and choice. Because, you know, not everyone's always a huge fan. Oh, we mode this, that, and the third. But, I mean, hell, people forget that even Raptor started off on the Wii 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 Wii. He was a Wiimote Did. Nunchuck kid. Wow. And then what's his That's face? why I like yes. beating him so much exactly. in Brawl. I was and like, oh, man, I never want to lose uh, to There was, there was plenty of Brawl players yeah. that absolutely... Bear, yeah. uh, Razor. Razor. Razor was another yeah. huge one, you know? Yep. like there So many good players. So yeah. seeing people in the 3DS and whatnot, my, I got monkey mitts. I, I can't possibly do it, but, you know, still, I love seeing it. So they're right into it. We're starting off right now. Winner semis. Wow. Swagmaster swagging out on Luma, just Let's eviscerating go. her right off the bat. Okay. But Mikey Del Bay, man, he's got a chance right? to make like, something happen with Solo Rosa. Like, like 10 seconds on the clock, or less, until Luma makes her reappearance back on stage. I'm loving the mind games, man. The run up, roll back, run up, roll back, run up, roll in. Yep. And then what do you know? You just got opened Oh, up. and there oh. he goes again, swinging for the fences. Luma is out of here twice, but at the same point, you have to deal with that weird situation of every time you opt to go in on Luma, how much percent are you taking from Rosa? Are you giving her the matchup by trying to play against the character who in the end of things isn't going to net you the win? It's going to net Rosa the win. Right, yeah, you have to make sure to make the most out of getting rid of Luma, right? Like, yeah, so far, Swagmaster's been getting rid of Luma and then still getting bopped, yeah, like, you know, like bopped in percent, unfortunately, because, you know, as you see here, Rosa doesn't need much. She needs not even 5% to open up, so while getting those Lumas is great, she's still maintaining stage control and racking percent. And this patient game from Mikey Del Bay, man, he's just so ready to retreat and keep himself away from Swagmaster. Mm -hmm. And now even, I think, a Rosa up smash will do the job real soon. Yeah. Oh, he, he should have gone for up smash there. That would have finished it. Down smash a lot weaker in terms of knockback. But here's a chance. Oh. Wow, she's so light. Very close, and he's looking for it again. But Luma definitely going to interrupt that. That big old bulky hitbox. And look at how PK Fire just actually sends Luma away mm -hmm. into tumble the first shot. Yeah, good awareness nonetheless, too. Okay, yeah, Swagmaster's starting to catch on to Mikey's tactics here. He's like, all right, if you're just going to run back every time, i got to chase a little deeper, and then that's no problem. Oh, and Zara offering great options here. You know, as you said before, between Zara and PK Fire, at least keeping Luma out, but still hasn't net him the proper situation, and that was a, wow. one of those to the hard face. situations to call against Rosalina and Luma. Luma coming back so fast, and Rosalina covering that roll distance. Even jumping seems like it might be good, but it's not. No, I want to see a New York Luma with Tim's on. <laughs> and the Yankee fitted. Yeah, yeah. That would be so hype. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's got to make that texture. Oh, oh! I was gonna say he's got the sandwich. If he had went into rapid jab, that could have been really cool. Like, get him right there. Both. Yes, exactly. A little uh, Rosalina and Luma sandwich, real quick. Yep. Oh, and is that for three? Man, but this has just been Lucas versus Rosalina. Forget about the and yeah, Luma. Yeah, exactly. Like that. That that has been knocked off the. <gasps> oh, spaghetti! Oh, and there it is. That is definitely a, just a little bit more patience needed there. Pasta from back home. Right, right there, exactly. Man. That was super unfortunate. He had basically Rosalina like packaged all ready to go, mm -hmm. ready for shipment, but just never sent out the order. Okay, and playing my, this long range game. Um, Mikey, right now, just playing that smart grind of a game. Keep killing my Luma, keep doing it, but I'm getting this residual damage and I'm already stock up, so you know, like, he just. Playing Cruz the way you're supposed to play Cruz, which is so hard to fight sometimes. Hold on to those stocks, man. Yep. Don't have to worry about finishing the match on time or anything. Oh, you know, like only dash attack. He could have up thrown. Yeah, and that's that. That's it. You know, it's. I believe, uh, uh, as they say in Canada, he's shook. <laughs> but there's plenty of time to unshake. He's still got two stocks left on the board. Swagmaster. And there it is, Mike Delby, oh. just with those resets. Look at this. This man has no interest in fighting him up front because he is playing it correctly, and that's why we sit here seeing Swagmaster eating so much percent. Man, all right. Mikey Tell Pay with this Rosalina. I'm really loving his style. He's so calm. And that's it. That's all it is. Starting to evolve, starting to adapt. 
finding all those ways in. And this new recruit for NYU doing amazingly in his Absolutely. first Absolutely. Got some hype from the NYU uh, fans in the They're audience. They're loving it right now. Yeah, keep rolling. Keep right? rolling. <laughs> uh, back throw to fair. Not going to work with that much rage. Actually, I don't believe it's a true combo most of the time, as long as your opponent DI's out. But everyone is usually DI'ing it improperly. Oh, and here's where we could see the Rosa shenanigans mm -hmm. come into play. Two up airs and this man's dead. Oh, I'm missing the grab, but a kind of frozen both players in place. Just not really sure what was going on there. Oh, I thought we were going to see the landing there. Swagmaster really trying to find something right now, but he can't at all. Oh, wow. Wow. That was a nutty exchange. That man. was. Red Luma, Red Rope Snake, Red Rosalina all right in there. I had no idea what was going on, but there we and go. There we Finally go. Finally going to take a stock. And this fight might so, be far from over, mm -hmm. depending on how well Swagmaster is able to establish his ground here. Oh, gets clipped off by down tilt. Oh, oh and there it is. Absolute destruction. There the it was. Three. You know? Wow. And that was actually super unfortunate that was for the, NYU because he didn't have to lose that stock. He well, that was, the, that was the first opportunity, too, that Swagmaster gave the opportunity at all to get to steal his up B. He was usually very good about it. He recovered with Tether and made sure not to uh, you know, put it out there, but right then and there. Yep. Hit the vacuum cleaner real, <laughs> real quick. Okay. And it's looking like we're actually going to see... Oh, wait. Is this uh? I think this is Ice Choppy, the the captain, because I didn't we didn't see him play. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool. So here we go. Ice Choppy, the last remaining member on the NJIT team who was not shown in their first round. It's gonna be Fox versus Rosalina. All right. Well, <laughs> Mikey Del Bay putting on an amazing show that first round. Able to take Swagmaster out with impunity, honestly. A JV3 stock. And it was looking so even at the mm -hmm. start, or at least fairly even. Yep. But as we saw, it was just... Mikey ended up playing it exactly as he was supposed to, and he came out with, you know, almost the exact stock count he wanted to. So, right. that's a man who stuck to the game plan, and that's what makes it such a fierce squad of guys. You know, they are well aware of their rule set. They know how to play within those rules, and they're showing what you got to be able to bring to the table to take them down. They're here for a reason. They're winners for a reason. It's serious. Yeah, and I mean, here we are, first seed versus fifth. Mm -hmm. This would be a huge upset if NJIT was able to take it, being their first appearance here on the collegiate circuit. So, I mean, anything can still happen. Yep. This is the anchor for uh, NJIT stepping up. So, I mean, it's also unfortunate they have to spend him so early. Yep. But I, I don't know. You got to keep yourself in it. You know, they're they're they. I, I think their game plan is seeming to be pretty well hashed, and I think they know what they're getting themselves into. So sometimes you got to call in big guns earlier than expected. They, I mean, they've no got way. the technology, right? Yeah, they're, they're the New Jersey is. Institute of Technology. So they've definitely got something up their sleeve. All right, wait, 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 wait. SD, SD, SD. It's okay. It's okay. There we go. Just restart. Just restart. restart. <laughs> no big deal. Sometimes it's easy to get caught up in the yep. heat of things, mm -hmm. and you, know, you just forget you're playing cruise. Just add yourself a stock, you know. Nobody. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> we take those. We <laughs> definitely do. Yeah, let like, you know. See, and that's why it's always smart, guys. Stay up on your tournament rulings and listings. You have to accept nothing that does not fall into the rule set. So that's that. That's what it is. You know. Make sure you're well aware. Make sure you know what's going on, and always <laughs> read the fine print. Man. Yep. Okay. Here we go. Because as we saw right there, that would have been a huge disservice to NJIT to have to sit there and go through another Rosalina and Luma stock. All right. Oh, I love, I love how it looks, the light show. Yep. We in the club. Yeah. yeah, they just said it, laser light show. It's so true, though. Okay. So Ice Choffee, man, this mystery fox. I wonder how it's going to play out for the kid. Mikey Del Bay still yet to even be touched. This guy just showing an ironclad defensive style. It's actually pretty amazing. A lot of run up and roll back too, especially when Rosalina is alone. I, I notice he totally changes his style. And for good reason. You know, the respect level definitely can find its way down. You have a lot more opportunity and there's just a lot more pressure you can instill on her. Whereas normally that's not the case at all because Luma ignores pressure. Yeah, she definitely helps you get out of it. Yeah. Oh, I'm liking these desyncs too from uh, Mike yep. Del Bay. Oh, that was almost a soul-crushing forward smash. 
and Mikey just doing such a good job of holding Fox out right now. Luma finally finding her way into the pit. Oh, oh, what's going to happen combos. here? Oh. Who does these things, man? Yo, so we need to send this guy to more tourneys. This Rosa is really creative. I feel like I see some potential in this guy. <laughs> but I mean, Ice Choppy hasn't really gotten the chance to get anything started. I'm sure he's got some stuff up his sleeve, oh, too. Oh, and opted for the death smash, not only on shield, but against a fresh Luma. That's got to be frustrating. Oh, a little bit late, but wow, Luma bailing him out with the yep. jab. Always good to have friends like that, man. Mm -hmm. Luma is there for you no matter what. Need some money for your rent? No problem. Oh! oh. And Rosa pays the bills on time. And that's unreal because, you know, Luma with that huge chunk of HP we know she has was sitting there just tanking those multi-jabs little bits yeah. percent over and over again. You're not going to do 50 with that. No. Nope. Let's put it that way. Mm, now the stock, the, count, the stock count is even, and this is not a good look for Ice, uh, Ice Chaffee at all. Oh, wow. Oh. This guy is so clever. I, I really like his Rosa, man. It, even though it didn't work, it was like, okay, I'm there covering, was an opportunity. covering that yep. back, yeah. Just to have that kind of presence of mind to look for something like that. Okay, going to pop him up with dash attack. Fox is off the stage, but no, able to get back on with that side B. That's one of the things that's really annoying about mm -hmm. fighting Fox, right? It's like that side B is so easy to hit, but gives him automatic stage presence if you uh, you don't punish him. Exactly, and it combos like that, and that is something that you always have to be on guard for because Fox's up air is ferocious. Yeah, exactly, especially against big floaty characters like Rosa. Yep, Dies huge super character early. frames. Yep. So easy to get hit by stuff like that, but I mean Rosalina with a really nonsensical up air of her own. Oh, I like the landing nair into jab. It's definitely some creative stuff from Ice Chaffee, but I mean it's given a it mixed results as of right now. And unfortunately, wow. when you have shit like that going on, you're definitely gonna have to be a little bit clear, more careful. <laughs> Ease for <laughs> All right, Pardon all right. my French, but there we're It's okay, we're Rosalina. all college students or, <laughs> or older here. <laughs> Rosalina and Luma, there's just things you have to be wary of that I can't give full credit to. <laughs> oh man, now I'm feeling old because I'm not a college student. <laughs> Putting that. <laughs> now I'm the old man overseer. There you go. <laughs> I'm like the gym teacher. <laughs> Jesus. All right. Anyway. Papa Max, catch him. <laughs> yeah. Ice Choffee Man, still with a chance <laughs> to get rid of Mikey Del Bay here, but. Oh, goodness. He went two socks down in the process, so even if he does take this match, NJIT still has a lot of work cut out for them. But, I mean, is NYU top seed about to not even drop their first player? Uh oh, yeah, he yeah. used his jump. That was something that we saw before with the Charizard, where he ran off yep. and accidentally yeah. used the double jump off the stage. But Ice Choffee having the presence of mind to fix that up. Yep. Trying to corral Rosalina and Luma, but not always an easy task, especially when you're a character like Fox. Oh, some nice shield pressure, though. There we nice go. Choffee making sure. Now there's some stage in. control. Oh, but an opportunity. I like that. Multiple hitboxes yep. on the fair, making sure he can, you know, bypass oh, the air dodge. There we go. There it is. Very nice. Good attention there. All right, Ice Choffee pulling it together after kind of a rough start to that match. And that was such a tight situation because he had the Luma in the right place, but it was just a, a second too soon on the input, so it did not cover that up smash, exactly. unfortunately. Great idea, unfortunately not optimal execution. Well, all right, Ice Choffee, maybe maybe he wasn't the anchor of the team and he was just saved for last in their first match, but I don't know. They're kind of figuring out the, the crew's meta. They're, they're, they and not to mention, as we said, we're working against first seed here, so they're kind of, you know, I'm sure there's got to be a certain play-by-play corrections as they go situation because it, it, it's a hard call you know you're not really sure where you guys are going to stack up as you said newer guy is going up against first seed it's a, it's a hard situation right okay and i believe we have uh cluey coming up is it oh yeah yeah yelk cluey backwards <laughs> all right this guy coming out Second season, I believe, that he's been on the roster. The first time he was not. Ah, returning uh, roster member. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Making varsity. <laughs> yeah, definitely. And making not graduated for a year plus. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, unfortunate to see Nixie and Ausla not able to play. Nixie, I don't believe he's... I, I think he moved to Cali or something? Uh, no, no, I don't think so, actually. I think he still lives in New York. Uh, but he got a job with... Didn't he? Didn't I want to say it was Nickelodeon. I don't know. I know that he beat East Sam in pools. Yeah, at, at Evo, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yo, shout out to Nixie, man. The secret Falcon boss in New York. Nobody knows this guy. Been hanging out for so long, too. Like, we all knew about him way back when. But it's funny, you know, the sleeper names from your region. Yep. When they finally, like, yep. break out in a national. Yeah, it's always hype. 
Yeah. All right, so Cluey, Zero Suit Samus player. He's got three stocks. Ice Trophy has to SD twice. Now, shout outs to Smash 4 in this aspect. This matchup is nowhere near as horrendous as it was in Brawl. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there are. Yeah, in Brawl, you can just down smash Fox 60 times until you get him to the edge of the stage yep. and then just down B or <laughs> do just, whatever you it, want. It was rough. Yeah. Wolf, Fox, and Falco, all the spaces. Yep. But in this game, not only do we not have Wolf, but we also don't have that infinite anymore. Actually, it does still kind of work, though. Really? Yeah. I remember people were doing it in early Smash 4, but it's not quite the same. Or as free. <laughs> as, as simplistic as just mashing your Z-Stick downwards. Yeah. But either way, we're going to still see a lot of reward every time mm -hmm. uh, that down smash gets landed. So, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is that it? Oh, oh wow. Man. Cluey making quick work of that stock. Just one combo. Yep, and that's... I'm surprised he died to that, man. That's, uh, I mean, I can't say so myself. I've definitely been caught off guard by it. It's something that comes at you very quickly, and if you're not ready and you don't DI correctly, that, that's stock. That early on, especially straight off the plat like that. Had it been off the ground, could have been a slightly better scenario, but coming off the plat, no chance. No chance at all. Man. That's ZSS for you. And Ice Toffee going to be the second player to fall for NJIT. Meanwhile, NYU's only lost one in the process, mm -hmm. being Mikey Del Bay. But now they've got, who I'm not sure if the, if Cluey's their strongest player, but definitely one of their best. And uh, I think that this is a uh, memorable face here in, uh, if I remember correctly, is this XD? This is XD the Jiggy Yeah, yep. I had a feeling. Yep. And he looks like, he just like has XD's a good time calling people <laughs> XD and Jiggy Puff, yeah. <laughs> like, this guy looks like a Jiggy He's got that smile on 24-7. Yeah. Ah! The eSports yeah. even grin, man. It's very subtle, but it's there. All right, well. NJIT now three stocks down. Uh-oh. <laughs> we good, we good. <clears throat> Getting in that quick promotion real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta advertise. Okay. So Cluey, early percent lead, basically already has puff at kill percent, man. <laughs> you get one up air to up B, and I'd say if it's near the edge, Jiggy Puff's gonna die to it. Uh -oh. oh, goodness. Oh, the mash, though. Yes. XD staying alive, and wow, Cluey just doing flips. <laughs> he doesn't even care. All day. What is this, Olympic gymnastics or Smash 4? And you just talk about seeing the aerial patterns and what space you're taking up on. Look at the mix ups right now. What? Definitely got XD really confused. Yeah, this is some extreme mind games. Yeah, like XD was hanging Ooh. out, thought that he had all the space in the world, and let me tell you. Okay, wow, and Louis actually, is all over this. Using Zare, too. I think uh, Zare's really good against characters like Puff, who kind of can oh. contend with Zero Suit's limb range, mm -hmm. but no way are they going to outrange that full Paralyzer whip. And wow, and almost in their kill, too. And I have to say, not to mention on top of all of this, just to add in. Oh! Insult to injury, getting a rest on ZSS can be no simple task either, I'd imagine, with that thin character frame. Yeah, she's that Betty Spaghetti. Yup. Yeah, you know, that's it. That sure is hell ain't Aunt Jemima. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, <laughs> definitely not. <laughs> she's thin with two ends. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Zero Suit Samus, man. A really devastating character with range, rage, especially if you're Jigglypuff. <laughs> And you're literally the lightest, <laughs> literally the lightest character in the game. Uh, you don't want to get caught by the early hits of that up B up top, man. It, it could spell an early death for you for sure. Oh, I thought he was gonna get him with an air, and then after that, Zero Suit pretty much gonna have her way with you. All right, but XD staying alive and here. There. He needs to win Just this match. missed that opportunity there too. Was doing such a good job covering space, but didn't account for the tether. Try to keep that sheer horizontal hitbox, and that might be it. Oh, oh just goes for the dash deck. I think he wanted to yep. turn around down smash, but just uh, missed the input. I definitely could see that much. Either that or just attempting to deal with the fact that Puff was close to breaking out. Oh, well, yeah, and XD's mashes have been on point, yep. too. Mm -hmm. Very, very quick. Grounded, yeah. Super proficient masher. But, I mean, is that enough? To keep you alive. I mean, it not might have the, avoided death in those individual situations. Not, the, the outright strategy was what the problem is here. Second, Cluey started using these flips all over the place. It seems like he's really corralled any of XD's ability to use that air like he normally does. So that's yeah. what we're seeing here. You know, he's opting for a lot of ground options. He's really felt out of sync, but oh, oh he still trade. holds it. XD able to hang on. Oh, he's got to be careful with those pounds, though. Even though it has such a long and wow. uh, and, and big hitbox, like a long-lasting one, mm -hmm. it's still very punishable if you miss. Oh, there we go. And exactly there it like is. That. Yep. Yeah. If you're not careful, though, trying to back air that, you could get caught by the ending frames mm -hmm. of the pound. Right. Oh. 
XD though, I mean, still a stock down here. Clue has been putting in so uh, much work. And the, the, the hard part of this matchup too is just the, yet again, those ZSS bread and butters. Between that and countering so much of the aerial space, this has been such an uphill battle for Clue. Like that. Oh, the Mars, man. Yep. The down B in the middle of the uh, the up air strings. Yeah, it's like, if you don't want to commit to that up B and you don't know it's going to work, mm -hmm. might as well just do the flip jump and see where it gets you. Cover air dodges too. Uh oh. Oh, and we yet again. Yeah. The get out of jail free card, the counter aerial spacing card. Oh, goodness. It's not looking good for XD here. Okay, Chloe just going to whiff a dash attack into the edge. That could have been a back air punish from uh, XD if you were more poised for the position, but it doesn't matter. Uh oh. Oh, no. Wow. Those mashes and there not coming was. back. Yeah. Tried the best he could, but man, that was very good coverage right there. Absolutely nailed his confirm. Closed out like a champ. This man on a tear, he's already taken four stocks, only yeah. dropping one in the process. And that match practically cast itself. You know, you saw it all right then and there. He made it very clear how he was going to counterplay that matchup and demonstrated exactly how hard Jigglypuff was going to have to work, even to get in residual damage. All right, now we're going to get McNasty, the weak fit Ooh. trainer. Coming in against Cluey, hoping to supersize that. So it's looking like they're saving the Little Mac for last. Maybe he was, you know, their strongest player, and that's why he steamrolled so hard in the first set when he came out. Either that, or they were unsure what his performance was going to be. And after he steamrolled, now they're saying, all right, new anchor. All right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's put our that, best. Put that, put that anchor back on the hook. And we got Cluey forgetting to SD. Oh, the hype is real. That should be a stock penalty. Yeah. <laughs> He paused. Alright, here we go. First stock of this match. <laughs> Going to the fishes, but now we're back into it. Alright, so we got McNasty holding it down for NJIT. Cluey getting right back in here. The countdown just about to finish. Now this should be interesting to see here. ZSS so good at breaking down defenses, so good at finding her way in. But at the same point, we fit as we spoke about before. Very good at holding her ground. Very good at keeping players out. So yeah, it just depends. Like this is a really hot versus cold match. Yep. Strong offense, strong defense. I'd imagine we're gonna see a lot of resets from McNasty here, just trying to create that space. Boy. He has shown that he can do close quarters combat, though, as we've seen, but. Right off the bat, Cluey, not only just converting, but mashing very hard, too. Oh, Okay, McNasty saw what he was doing yep. to XD's Jigglypuff, and he's like, okay, I'm not going to air dodge. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to jump away. Oh, Ooh. some clashes, but Zero Suit with the frame one jab. Yep, She's exactly. able to just win those mash wars every time. Very hard to deal with. Holding that shield button sometimes the better option. Not always, though. Oh, whips the get-up attack right in his face. And Cluey. frame one jab, so ruthless, man. Just so hard to deal with when you're doing close quarters at all. Yeah, we Fit Trainer definitely not the character you yep. want to be when you're fighting somebody who's always just in your face like this. If you're not able to shake the pressure from Zero Suit off, then this is a pretty ugly matchup. Just look at Cluey move though. This guy's so fluid. Definitely is. And I very good at the chase nonetheless too. He's really finding his positioning very well. But at the same point though, McNasty, you know, still getting his. Still not completely out of this. Starting to build that percent back up. Okay, Chloe, look at this airtight pressure, man. Yeah. Oh, spacing those back airs. Oh, oh and she actually died goodness. when starting yes. breathing. If only you had taken that breath before, man, and healed the two percent, you might have actually been able to live that attack. You got to be so careful when opting for some of those B moves. They they really can leave you in a predicament. That was so interesting. How Chloe went for Nair to F tilt, and then it actually looked like he was going to get some more off of it, but McNasty responded, sun salutation to the face. But this is uh, still not looking good. Chloe hanging on to two stocks, and he's got all the momentum wow, in the world. And there it is. Watch where you're playing soccer, kid. No ball playing on this Smashville field. Nothing. Chloe and his crew are holding it down right now. They are super hyped. Oh, so nimble, man. <laughs> she lands with no lag from that if you don't do any attack out of it. Oh, man. Loving the play from Cluey here, but McNasty, man, he's still got a chance. He just needs to land one of those big Wii Fit kill moves right now. 
any of her smashes or a back air. And there it wow. is. A little Tarzan with the start off of the swing and then getting everything underneath. I love it. Absolutely love it. And comes clear across the stage. Ooh. Ooh. Man, if he converted, I'm pretty sure that would have been like top 10 stylish moments. Like that was absolutely ridiculous. Underneath the stage to clear across the stage. Like this man is just running uh -oh. it. Oh, I thought he was just gonna go for the Look up at this. but he didn't believe. Oh, oh what? Seventy-five percent, man. Who? Yeah, who is Chloe? That, yeah, that's like, what NYC. <laughs> Seven stocks down. Seriously, so far to that this man guy. was running like public transportation, dude. All never stops. Never day. stops. They Taxpayer gave, money keeps going. They gave him, him his own lane and everything, and unfortunately, right there, McNasty found himself in the wrong lane of traffic because that was not. It says stopped. bus only, dude. Yeah, you gotta, that's you what it was. All right, but doing yoga in the street, bro. It's not a good look. Looks like CSMS is going to be coming up, though. He's got to take two stocks from Cluey and then six more from the rest of the team. Well, he did it. He did eight. Eight was his running total the last time they played. So let's see where he stands now. Yep. Now at the same point, though, open it up against the CSMS. Oh, I'm sorry. Not, not. Yeah, he has to take two from Cluey and then nine more total. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So an entire player worth more than he had taken the last game, and his last game seemed like a shining light. So we're gonna see. Yeah, I mean, this is uh, this is the team to beat right now. NYU, Cluey showing you why. But I'm really excited for finals. Uh, just saying, like if Cluey, you know, completes the steamroll, wins this 11-3. Matchup that's looking like very much in his yes. favor right now. Yeah, it should be very interesting to see nonetheless because it, they have come out strong, they have continued on being strong, and they are clearing through right now with a solid eleven stock lead. Oh, uh, eight stock. Eight They're stock. up eight. Okay. Yeah, eleven to three. Yeah. So I don't know, man. I mean, it's looking like going ahead here. Finals will probably be NYU versus Montgomery, and they've always placed very well. I believe they always get third and fourth behind Rutgers and uh, UMD for the last two seasons. So, um, with both of those teams auto-qualified from last season because we kind of merged seasons yeah. two and three, um, you know, their demons are gone. There so you go. These guys are going to be advancing. Actually, uh, the top four teams advance, so they're, like, everyone except Brooklyn College is going to be going to the next round. Okay, gotcha. But they're playing here for basically seeding. Mm. All right, Cluey tossing that stock. Yep. Going to take him a while. Wants to do it in style. Yeah, he, he has two stocks left. We're good to go. Yep, the countdown is good to go. One, go! There we go. Oh, CSMS with wow, some really creative strings is. here. Uh-oh. And he's going to have to be really careful here. With Louis used to down B, any grounding can result in very hard situations quickly. Yeah, and when you're Little Mac, man, getting popped in the air once could be a juggle to your death. Oh, and he was looking for the two frame. On that uh, down B, or I'm sorry, up B recovery from zero suit. Almost breaking the shield with the angled down forward smash, which is actually so, so scary. Oh, wow, right now. Right now, both players just trying to figure out where each other are. Yeah, <laughs> man. You know, like, back to back, baby. Definitely some nutty outcomes in the early stages here, but yeah, CSMS, man, holding it down so far. And definitely making Cluey rethink a lot more of his approach than he has in any of the previous battles. You can tell he's trying to pick his opportunities. He's trying to punish those landings. Oh! I was just about to say, CSMS is saying, Cluey, you're not going to get anything free for uh, free from me yep. like you have on the other matches. But no, it doesn't matter. It's so hard to shut this guy's style down. Oh! And there it was. Great punish right there. Got everything and a bag of chips. The proper timing and the right amount of charge. and just closes out that stock. Not going to make anything easy here for Cluey. And I love that. Started opting for the F-Tilt yet again, too, because he knows that the F-Smash most likely will not have the range to get that. Doesn't matter, though. Cluey getting right in there. Uh-oh. Oh. Popped him up to the top of the screen and still not finding his way back to the ground, which is a rough scenario. Yeah, and if CSMS is only left with one stock to finish this with, oh, he tried. He yep. tried. He tried to find his way back to the ground, and that's something he's really got to pay attention for. But that cross up on shield could pr <laughs> oh, prove detrimental. Oh, no. I wonder if the balloon actually made that possible, but it looks like it would have been laggy enough. All right, Cluey, are you going to make the clean sweep? Or are you going to let someone else get some credit? Oh, man, and again. Just needs a little bit more residual damage on those shields, and he can have a huge opportunity, but this could be something way bigger than that. Okay, gets the angle down. Oh. He knows knockback wasn't what he needed. Oh, that could have been it. 
Little Max still just basically a good smash attack away from winning this here. Oh, oh and we coming back big time. Oh. Just missing that. Yeah, if he maybe did up smash, would have hit a little closer to his face. Oh god, this is so tense. Oh no, I thought he was just gonna like drop shield KO punch after he got the block. Oh no, he had a chance there. <gasps> what? Yo, Chloe is insane! Okay, that's it. Wow, 11, no, 10, 10 stalking. NJIT, wow. I was not expecting that. I, I felt, how well I was felt the anxiety there from, from CSMS. It was just, it was such a tight situation. He knew he couldn't take a right. single hit while trying to get away. Oh, good.